Okay, so this is a channel that I follow. It's called the, the Shiki Science Show. And Shiki is basically a uh, longevity researcher. She studies senescent cells specifically and senolytics. So she put out her new video a few days ago about what she felt were the most influential or some of the biggest surprises in longevity science in the last year of 2021. So in, interestingly enough, within that, she had an article about the reprogramming of cardiomyocytes in mice in vivo. So this is actually within the mice itself, not in a petri dish. And they found they could actually turn back the um, the state of the cells and increase the functionality of them by using what are called Yamanaka factors. Yamanaka factors are four transcription factors, this is years ago, that were found to be able to take an adult state cell and reverse it back to more of a um, a fetal state, essentially, right? To take something from a differentiated cell back to more or less a stem cell. And um, this was done actually successfully in vivo now. And the interesting part about this is they found that it was able to reduce scarring of the heart. So the scar tissues and the fibrosis were actually reduced. And the uh, I think they said the systolic functionality of the heart was increased again. So this has a lot of interesting... Um, a lot of interesting implications for improving the functionality of our organs and if it can produce uh, improvements in fibrosis in the heart it makes you wonder what it can do for the lungs so anyways her whole video is worth checking out her channel is great the only thing I would tell people uh, initially is that she moves very quickly her, a lot of her information is very advanced and she moves very rapidly highlights things very rapidly I have a degree in molecular biology microbiology and even I have a hard time following some of her stuff it moves very quickly and it's the same as science you know it, the, the technology moves re very quickly and it's you know you take a one-year break from actually reading research and you'll find yourself overwhelmed but the information is top-notch and um, uh, of all the channels I think she's one of the ones that I would recommend the highest if you're interested in health span uh, lifespan longevity molecular research it's it's all there but just be warned you know you may not get it the first time around Sometimes I got to go back and look at it myself. It's uh, it's overwhelming, but it's great information. I can't recommend it enough. So hopefully this will help some people start off a better new year. And um, uh, at least the science, at least the information out there looks bright. Um, it's kind of nice. It's always a, it's a little bit inspiring when you see hum humanity kind of refusing to to go into the darkness so easily and and kind of fight the walls and the barriers we've been dealt. You know. And it's real. That's what also makes it interesting. It's very, very real. It's not just storytelling. It's not just ideas. It's actually a real path. We have a real pathway and a road map to move forward. So anyways, thanks. Thanks for listening. And uh, hopefully this is of use to some people. And uh, have a good Saturday.